Two-tier policing? Two-tier policing? What about two-tier brain functions? Um, for my sins, I woke up and I stuck on talk radio. Listening to the fat jab of a hot motherfucker that calls himself Mike Graham. The Independent Republic of Mike Graham, brought to you by Rupert Murdoch. That's how independent of a republic that fat jab of a hot motherfucker who probably can't fit through a normal door frame, never mind breathe or uh, he's one hamburger away from a heart attack. Now, this is the this is the route the right wing press is going down to try and uh, water down what the far right is doing in this country. Uh, kind of defending them. Two-tier police system. I mean, where were the people? Where were the cops with riot shields when there was a bunch of fucking B.O. and weed smelling <laughs> Jesus sandal wearing hippies walking about shouting free Palestine, you know? Why wasn't there fucking people with helmets on and big riot shields smacking those people about? Some would say it's because they were on a protest and they were marching peacefully. Uh, contrary to all the fucking Jews and uh, pro-fucking Israel and Zionist press walking about, I felt threatened by them seeing stuff I didn't like. And then they're trying to act like, ah, why are the cops doing two-tier policing? Why when a bunch of football casuals launching bricks wheelie bins, setting shit on fire, uh, bricking mosques, fucking smashing houses up, smashing cars up. <laughs> Two-tier policing. Two-tier policing. Two-tier brain functions of all the windy lickers out there that are joining in in this pish. And I'm wondering... Why aren't the police beating up peaceful protesters? And then all we do is turn up and start setting shit on fire and hitting the cops with bricks, chairs, planks of wood, setting things on fire and all that. Why are they getting heavy-handed with us? Huh? I don't get it. Fucking window-licking fucking morons.